guys, it's Christina Marie from Very Easy Makeup, and I haven't done a video recently, so I thought I would do kind of a fun one on should I get side bangs or not? Because a girl doesn't know. Um, so this is my hair today. I didn't wash it yesterday, so it looks greasy because I didn't want to overdo it. So as you can see, at one point in time, I did have side bangs, like three years ago. Um, but most of the time my hair falls kind of flat and to be honest, I usually just wear my hair in a ponytail, but according to my mother, I should fluff my hair and have side bangs. So I don't want full on bangs mm -mm, because it always bothers me and then it makes me break out. Um, but I'm thinking about getting side bangs today. So I figured I would show you guys a before and after video. Um, so this is a before video of my hair. Um, I'm also going to get it trimmed. I want it so oftentimes I debate what length to have my hair. I personally, this is just me, I hate it when it's above my shoulders. Um, it looks really good when they first cut it and then unless I style it every day, it looks kind of like a boy's haircut and I don't style my hair every day. So I'm going to ask her to keep it below the shoulders. I think that's just safe. Um, but the ends look kind of straggly. So I'll probably have her trim the back. Um, this is what it looks like. I have no idea what it looks like in the back. Um, but I'm going to ask her to cut off probably two inches, maybe three. Um, we'll see to make it look better on the back side. Um, so yeah, we'll see how it turns out. I actually bought a Groupon because I don't want to pay $60 for a haircut. So it was only $25. Um, also wanted to get your guys' thoughts. So leave a comment below on my hair color. So I switch up my hair color constantly. Um, right now it's not as dark as it is sometimes when I use the John Frieda treatment to make it truly brunette. Um, this is probably what I would call a very dark blonde. So I stopped bleaching my hair with bleach probably eight months ago, 10 months ago. I haven't really bleached it that much at all. Maybe done the roots, but honestly, if anything, I just use toner with developer. So right now, what I actually have on my hair, and I did this three days ago, it took 30 minutes, was I just mixed the Wella T18 Ash Blonde Toner with developer. Um, put it on my hair for 30 minutes and rinsed it out with conditioner. Um, so when you just use toner, the developer actually lightens up your hair a little bit. So I should have done it before and after a video. I didn't. But as you can see, my roots are completely blended in because I used the developer with a toner. Um, before doing that, my hair was getting to be a little bit orangey, which I hate. So I probably tone my hair about every month or so during my lunch break because it only takes 30 minutes to shake it up. Um, so anyway, this is the Wella T18 toner on my hair. Um, my natural hair color is probably, it's still lighter than my eyebrows, so I'm still considered blonde by most people. But anyway, wanted to get your guys' thoughts on whether I should go blonde again or darker or keep it this color. Um, so anyway, yes, this is my before before the haircut video and then I'll come back tonight or this afternoon to show you guys the after results in case you're ever debating whether you should get side bangs or not. Until later guys, I'm back and I actually did a lot more than just side bangs. So originally when she cut my hair, she had longer side bangs like this. And I said, I really don't like how my head looks up here it's kind of thin, which is very common for most women. Um, how do I cover it up? And she said, well, I can give you some bangs. And I said, uh, sure. So this is the after, um, like it or not, I like it cause it's a fun change and I haven't had bangs in ages. Um, she did not give me little kid bangs. Well, maybe she did. You be the call. Anyway, I got some wispy side bangs. And she ended up cutting off actually like three and a half inches of my hair, which is 
a fair amount. Um, I originally told her keep it below the shoulders and she gave me definitely above the shoulders, but I actually kind of like it. So um, if you ever are thinking of going shorter with bangs, this is what you look like afterwards. Um, she actually originally shorted, suggested chin length and I said, no, 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 not that short. Um, so this is what it looks like. If you decide to go with uh, side bangs and a haircut. I will say she gave me two tips, um, three tips of things to use for your hair. So the first thing that she did, which I had never thought of, was using a wax um, for the bangs. And I can't even feel the wax touching it, but it just keeps them in place. Um, she used a product called Provana, so I will include a link below. Um, she also suggested that I use a hair treatment, which shocker with me dyeing my hair every month, every woman should do. Um, so she suggested the Olaplex number three, which you can buy online for damaged hair. Um, it says to leave it on for 10 minutes. She said you can go ahead and leave it on all night. So I'll probably be doing that to help make my hair stronger and healthier. And then her third tip is to use the, uh, what's it called? Number 10, uh, why am I forgetting the name of it? I'll post a link below. Um, it's the, it's like the most popular hair treatment before you curl your hair. Ooh. I used to use it all the time and then I stopped buying it. So I'm gonna buy it myself. I will include a link below. So the hair treatment conditioner, the wax, and the daily, it's a 10, that's what it's called. It's a 10 to use on my hair daily. Um, there's a keratin treatment one and a blonde one and a regular one, all of them are good. Um, so yes, this is the after of side bangs. Way to go, um, the lady at Twisted Elegance in Atlanta, Georgia. She's awesome. So um, this Groupon actually surprisingly worked out really well. So in summary, if you're thinking of getting side bangs, hey, go for it. I'm filming this during coronavirus. So if I had hated it, it wouldn't be a big deal. I don't have to go to work the next day. Um, so let me know what you think. Most guys like, me with longer hair and probably no bangs. So if you happen to be a guy watching this for some, some reason, let me know. Um, anyway, please subscribe to my channel up here. Maybe it's over there. I don't know. And check out veryeasymakeup.com. I have been busy writing because I've been waking up at 2 a.m. or 3 a.m. So until next time, guys, enjoy the rest of your day. Bye.